foot 11 caught on camera a bizarre attempted break in at a home in the Tower District. It happened shortly after midnight last Friday night. And tonight, we now know the name of the suspect. We also talked with the homeowner who armed herself during the bizarre incident. The homeowner, Christine Pauls, says that at first, her Friday night started out just like any other night. It first started out, I was binge watching Gilmore Girls and I was sitting on the couch. Christine Paul's husband was out with friends, and then... And then the doorbell rang. She thought it was her husband, so... I opened the door. But it wasn't her husband, it was a stranger, a woman. I asked her, can I help you? She said something about looking for her daughter, to which Christine responded... No one's here, your daughter's not here. And then... I shut the door. As she watched through her doorbell camera, things were about to get crazy. Coming in! The shouts turned violent. And then a running body slam against the door. And again, she finally breaks the window. You can see the shards of glass go flying. She then pulls the screen off the window. She's coming in through the window. What is going on? Inside, Christine calls 911. A retired police officer with Fresno State, she pulls out her gun. Yeah, her head was here. I saw her head and her arms, and her left arm was reaching in. Christine, now armed, issues a warning. I'm having to make that decision, you know, do I shoot? Finally, the suspect, who is now identified as 30-year-old Hannah Nakagawa, who, believe it or not, is a first-grade teacher with Fresno Unified, retreats. She until a Fresno police officer pulls up, then this exchange. Hi. Hi. Do you live here? No, I don't. No, I don't. She Christine says it was all like a TV show. And not the Gilmore girls either, more like... Like the walking dead. Fresno police say for now that suspect is facing only misdemeanor vandalism charges. They also say it appears that she was under the influence of something.